welcome everyone to CATCAM CA tutorial point I am Himadri Dotto I have made some of the mechanical SOLIDWORKS and see CATIA videos so do subscribe my channel if you are a mechanical guy and let's go to our topic so at first we have come to the ANSYS workbench here today we will study the fatigue analysis of a connecting rod of a piston so at first we have to go to the static structure click one double click on static structure then go to the model select import geometry browse here I have previously created one connecting rod SOLIDWORKS drawing I have just import it you can make another then double click on model so it takes some time for the starting the mechanical so you can skip some of minutes until it will appear so please wait some time at first you have to come to the ANSYS workbench then go to the static structural part and here you can see the mechanical part is open and the mechanical part there will be my connecting rod so at first when you come here then at first you have to go to the mesh right click and click on generate mesh please some wait and the generate mesh will be happen now go to the static structure insert force go to the face icon select these faces and click here apply now go to the vector I will go not go for the vector I go will go for the component y component will be minus 15,000 neutral and click here ok now go for the again static structure insert and fix support what is the fix support this is the fix support click here this face and click here apply ok now with this has been done now go to the solver window it takes some time for the solve Is wet. If I okay, now go for the solution insert deformation total deformation again. Go to the solution insert stresses equal von Meissel stresses and this is the fixed support and force now go for the solution again here you can see that that is the deformation here that I am just before go to the fatigue I am just telling you the deformation and von Meitzel stresses this is the animation how the deformation will happen okay and if you go to the von Meissel stresses you can see the stresses here how the stresses are generated here now we have to go to the fatigue analysis now to perform the fatigue analysis you have to make one thing that go to the solution insert and fatigue and then go to the fatigue tool okay here the domain type is time fatigue strength factor you all always keep it one then go to the type that will be fully reversed here are the many zero biased fully reversed other options are available you choose fully reversed scale factor is one 
okay now go to the analysis type this will be stress life mean stress is none stress component will be signed on my cell stresses okay here there will be and the units name cycles here you can choose cycle block second minute hours anything uh, uh, then you have to calculate the fatigue life then uh, it may be in days in may cycles then i am going to choose it cycle and that the cycle is equal to how many days or cycle then it's okay uh, then i will choose here and the days okay uh, one cycle is equal to um, one cycle is equal to uh, two days okay now done here uh, go there, goes here then it is okay go to the fatigue tool insert life go to the fatigue tool insert damage okay now we have to go to the solver window and then the solution is happened then you have to go to the life then you can see this the life will be shown showing here 1.574 minimum and 1.574 maximum and there you can see this damage here and if you go to the fatigue tool and here if you choose here the cycles and then make it solve you can see this is also showing the life and this is also showing this damage here so one change here that in the fatigue tool you have just uh, mean stress theory will be Jarvar and uh, then fully reversed and von Weissel stresses if you make it days and give here one day and then go for the solve then you can see the another solution this is the damage this is the maximum damage this is the fatigue tool this is how we can show here the fatigue analysis and this is the total deformation you can see that this is the going to the total deformation and this is the equivalent stresses in this how we can make the fatigue analysis do subscribe my channel share with mechanical friends and give one like it may, uh, may motivate you so thank you all i uh, please wait for the another new video